It's going to be an exciting one. G2 versus Gen G. Europe versus the LCK. Uh, here comes the teleport, actually, as Caps looks to join the fray. Has that? Stop, let me go. Gotcha, Stun card locked in. They dive onto Rascal. Rascal gets a stun once again. And first blood goes Gen G. Answered quickly by G2. BDD's teleported in behind him. I'm in danger. Behind his turret. Caps caught out by two. Nowhere for him to go. The Emperor slides in and gets his first kill of the series. Losing that flash from Mickey. Heard of him. Hexagoda made him into the Destiny Stormbringer, will not save the Volley Bear. The Destiny comes in, Cleared once again, the one they're looking to catch out. Life this going forward, there's a stun on Cleared. Babby caught out in the jungle and taken down. Life will follow shortly after and hear the picks. G2 have been looking for, the curtains open, Mickey flashes the wall. BDD is sniped by perks. Space call. Wow, are they really committed to this? Life, there's the Cosmic Radiance. Wonder dives onto the back line and Life's already dead before the ult can even come down. They commit it, the sleep comes down onto two. Actually, three members of G2 as Caps now steps forward. Very low on mana, but gets it all back. The new yeah. 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 Dived onto the back line. G2 looking for another one of their fights as they take down two early on. The Destiny looking for that flank position as Caps steps forward. Oh, don't fucking run away from me! Towards the top lane as G2 continue their advance through the river. Rune Boom. has nowhere Boom. to go. Wonder chases him down and slices him up with his legs. And now Rascal, the last one on the menu. G2, get the ace in the top lane. On your screen, you can see the Genji coming to the Baron. Destiny spotted him out. Wonder on his way. Doesn't have the teleport to join the fray. Caps gets a stun card. You can see Rascal locked out. BDD flashes forward, lands onto perks. There's a dazzle. The cleanse doesn't get him away, and there's one kill already for Gen G. Mickey coming from the side as Wonder dives onto the BDD on the back line. Two for two so far as Caps now gonna step forward. Clint low, life low, everyone on Gen G's low. G2 take them all and three survive. It was a close game until it wasn't, Vedius. From 300 gold the difference to 12,000 at the end as G2 send a statement in game one. <laughs> has the stun. Oh, but another engaged bot lane. Life ignited. Mickey looking for the acquired taste. Life is ticking Ooh. down, but he will be able to survive. Mickey ticking away as well. Perks does have heal in this matchup. His Yankles on his way down as well. And Life, of course, has no flash. There's the heal. They try and get Life out. But watch out, Eep Life. Perks, Zenith bladed on. Life survives. Yankles on him to take the kill. That's a double for Ruler in the bottom lane, in the top lane. Rascal kills Wonder. Wonder kills him in response. Ruler will fall to Yankos, but what an incredible play. Uh, whereas Genji consistently go for them, and now Genji look for a fight in the mid lane, but Mickey is here and Perks is here, and Clid oh, is no longer. He's gone back to the founder. BDD tries to flash away, but there's no escape. The Solar Flare! Stopwatch from BDD underneath the tower. Perks looking for the fourth shot. We'll get it. Rascal comes in from the side. The arrow's gonna land from downtown as well. Solar Flare stolen away there by Caps. As Life looks for the re-engage, Ruler stepping forward. There's a stun, and now Ruler's been put to sleep. Underneath the tower, he is dozing off, and Yankos will happily accept that kill. Mickey's been caught out, BDD going on the chase here onto Wonder, Yankos trying to join the fray, it's Caps not able to join this fight yet, you can see Yankos almost down, life on the front lines, gonna get slept, but he can use the Gargoyle Stone Plate to hit himself back up, now it's, it's a great fight for they push forward, but the Solar Flare finds three on the back line, it's a double for Caps and the curtains have opened, and perhaps this is the encore the Perks was looking for, BDD sniped down, a triple for Caps, add more pages to the book! as the Medjai Soul Stealer is all the way up to 25. And now with this uh, Red Bull Baron of Power play, G2 continue to take down at structure. Solar Flare is going to hit on towards the back line. That's Perks caught out, but you can see Life almost down before you can even get out of the fight. Ignite taking on Caps, use it the stopwatch to dodge the spear. He's going to come back up and with the ammo, oh my god! Oh, that is disgusting! That is the most illegal ammo I've ever That's seen! Oh. Clint dives in, Rascal dives in, but they're already done, and Caps is still alive, and he's almost back up to full HP! Ruler, the last man standing, and what a fated end it is for Genji as he goes down! Another triple for Caps! This has been, once again, a demolition from the LEC number one seed as they go 2-0 up versus Genji. <laughs> Level 6 mark that you talked about, Bedias, BDD, 5 at the moment, Life going in, here's the TB, and Life may be overstepped, flashes away, but the teleport coming in from Gases looks for the chase, dives forward, can't quite get the damage, the thick skin comes out from Life, but Life hit with a dancing grenade, and G2 are dancing all the way to the bank with that kill. Yankos now has a flank position, level 6, 
Gen G, a little bit underneath their tower. So we just talked about it. No teleports, no destiny. That control ward is outside of the bush, so they don't know that Yankos is waiting, and Caps comes in with a destiny of his own. He has a date with the semi-finals, and G2 take two in the bottom lane. He's been fighting Gen G as much as possible, but might not get the opportunity is... Gold card coming out with the charm. I'm gonna put some dirt in your eye. BDD, Clint now diving in. He's charmed immediately. Lamps Despite comes down just in time. Clint able to save his life. BDD going in with the sun card once again. Onto Yankos, but Clint, look at how low he is. Wonder slices and dices up Gen G. Two Quick kill to G2, and Rascal is running for the hills, but the Stormbringer is brought down. Caps alone to the wards at the back of the pit. The Destiny comes in for BDD, and Caps is on the blast cone, tries to go over the wall, just about survives. Gen G collapse, and now the Inferno Dragon, the target, Cliff's gonna dive in. There's the quickness, the Stormbringer, Gen G looking to turn this final oh, into the game for the Inferno. Nice but it's taken by yeah. Yankos, it's taken by G2, and they'll take a kill to top it off. Wonder down, Rascal down, the TP coming in from Caps, as Gen G on the wrong side of the rift. Here comes Caps, GLP for the slow, Cliff, BDD locks in the stun card, and uh, smashes it straight at Caps. G2 just have to wait, but they're not going to. They're going to go go BDD is almost dead. The Rascal tries to keep him alive. Rascal trying to get to the back line. The Rams are Wait a minute. By life. Rascal dived on. Quickness being Send used as well. Way. Rascal doesn't have anyone to help him. Doesn't have anywhere to go. He's down. Caps used the Lemmy Smith to keep himself alive. Yakos on the chase. Clint has died. Life has died. G2 have done it. Gen G, unless Ruler and BDD can pull a rabbit out of a hat, they are done. The deadly blow is connects. BDD goes down. G2. Four for none, and now they're pushing for the win. I don't know if he can hold the line. G2 looking to end. G2, they don't want Ruler to survive, and he will fall. Life up in five, but it's too little too late. G2 will carry the hopes of the West into the semi-finals. They will carry the hopes of Europe into a showdown against Dam1 Gaming after they're done demolishing Genji on their fountain. Mickey's been a standout through the entirety of World. <laughs> Are they going to throw him in the water? Oh, no, they throw him in. <laughs> he can't swim. <laughs> okay. Oh, that was close. That was oh. so <laughs> <laughs>